Hey guys, Ghostface CX, welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2. We're gonna continue with wherever we have to go next. Uh, let's see here. World 2. Oh, I think we. Oh, no, wait, I have one more star I can do before we start this. That's the boss level of this world, but I have one more star we can do back in Cosmic Cove. So let's get started on that. Shall we? Exploring the Cosmic Cavern. I like Cosmic Cove Galaxy. It's really fun. It's a nice galaxy. But this is, like, one of the areas where you'll see the most, um, underwater parts in the game. Even though it starts out as ice. He's saying, get me out of here. So star bits fall on top of the ice, which is always pretty cool. And we can still get these eight star bits up at the front, 16 total. And backwards skating for the win. Uh, those guys I could just ignore. Now this is the pipe we're supposed to be heading for. And we star bits. I've never probably actually said this, but you can actually like collect star bits just by walking into them. Alright, so let's just wall jump up here. Star bits galore, but then again it's galaxy. So why wouldn't there be star bits? Alright, let's see here. That just gives you a coin. That was awesome. So anyway, we're going underwater. We can shake the wheel mode to get a little bit of a faster boost. On um, the air gauge right there, you're going to need to refill that by getting coins or air bubbles. Air bubbles refill more than coins do, but they're not as common really. And there's a flip switch right there. And eels. Press Z to dive on the nunchuck. It's kind of a more efficient move underwater. It's definitely helpful in going past these guys. So yeah, definitely take note of that. Now we get this pipe. And then we get to come up here, which is a, like a 2D kind of platform. But look at this. Water that is floating. Does that make sense? No, I didn't think so. So when we can climb up here, there's this line that we really don't need to worry about. We don't need to worry about that one up either. And these mines are just really easy to get past. That one's kind of annoying because it kind of blocks the path up there, but whatever. And you can always resurface. And you can jump on him to get up there. Now this one, you're going to have to... Be careful, there's something like this in New Super Mario Bros. Wii, but I never got to show it. Uh, and then once it's, the cubes are pushed up together, we can just swim across the gap. And then there's that. And look at that, there, I probably missed it, but that Luma was made entirely out of Star Bits, and I spun into that key, which is pretty freaking epic. So, yeah. Getting all those star bits, that's a, that's a good grinding spot for star bits. I mean, we just got a one-up from it. And now this little dude's gonna transform. It's more human in there. Eh. It's been pretty human this year, actually. And we get more star bits. So uh, we start up here. We don't really need to talk to the Toad Captain this time. There's a star. I wish we could just land on the platform right there, but no. We have to go through all this. And you'll notice that you can't drill through the entire planet. I think it's like this patch or something that you can drill through easily. Yep. Now what you're going to have to do is go to these guys, drill into them. Oh wow, I actually got the key on the first shot. Nice. These guys can only be killed by ground pounds and the drill. So just keep that in note. There are drills drills abound and so go to this patch of dirt with the waters coming out of it and it'll make this entire area like actually filled up with water and you lose your drill so it's not that big of a loss really 
So anyway, there's a star in about five minutes. That's pretty good. And we got a star. So, um, really, I don't know if there's a whole lot else that we can do. Oh, wait, we have a little character add-on. Um, another star. More star bits. More coins. Got a penguin that's sassy on the spaceship. Well, he wants a word with us. Yeah, because penguins can actually have words in this game. Go figure, right? Shake, yeah, I already explained that. Most penguins don't know that. Well, I'm not a penguin, so I know that. <laughs> ah, do a long jump. Alright, so I really don't think we have anywhere else to go in this one. Oh, there's a secret mission there. I'll come back to that, because I, I want to do this. This is Bowser's Lava Lair. Yep, we're finally going out of the Bowser level of this game. Now, the rule for the final boss of each world is that odd number worlds like 1, 3, 5 have Bowser Jr. and 2, 4, and 6, the even numbers have Bowser. So that's definitely something good to keep in mind. And we get this awesome music of awesomeness. No matter if it's a new song or an old remix, it's still pretty awesome in this game. And we just kill him, and we get a pull star. Pull stars aren't as used often as much, so, but you just point at them and grab on with a. They're not that that much. They're, they aren't really used that much as they were in the first game. But ground pound this to get a higher boost. Eh, uh, boy. So now all we have to do is grab the life mushroom. And, um, wait, is this, is that this part right here? Come on, where is it? I could have sworn there was a secret over here or something. No, it's just that. Alright. Somewhere else in this level I'm thinking of that has a certain, like, starboard pattern. Alright, yeah, more TVs. I do not need your help. Ah, gosh darn it. Now, this is a hammer, bro. And you can actually spin while you're crouching. That's really funny. Yeah, there's star bits in the lava. Ah, oh, there's a pattern that I was looking for. I want to actually grab those star bits if I can ever see them. And there we go. Ah, darn it. We can grab these coins, and that'll give us a one-up. Now, long jump into the oblivion! Oh, wow, I actually made that win. Alright, now these are thwomps. Let's just wait till he turns around. And you can crouch and crawl under his legs. Go back on top of him, ground pound him in the back. Star bits and there's like actual rubble there, which is pretty funny. Now here's the common metal. Alright, I know we can get it with while we're standing on him. See? So these are the meteors that are gonna be in Bowser levels pretty frequently. So just get up on them, get in the middle of this, ground pound, and that breaks the switch. And I wanna see. <laughs> I actually killed myself. I've always wondered if you kill yourself that way. <laughs> if you could kill yourself that way. I've always wondered that. Well, I figured that out. Alright, let's just go up to this guy and kill him. Kill him for star bits. Pattern for the wing. Uh, normally you're supposed to just ground pound this and you'll come down here. And there are dry bones. But really, there's not a whole lot to be worried about here. Alright, come on. Let me crawl under you. Oh. Alright, there's your common metal again. 
So yeah, be careful with your timing on that. Just saying. Now you're gonna have to wait till this like purple light comes, and it'll take you up. Beat me up, Scotty. Uh, oh boy, these are the matter monsters. I believe their name is. I'm not sure if that's official or not, but they eat the floor, basically. Although it does come back after a while, and the snake platforms have returned. I hate these snack the snake platforms. These are like one of the more advanced puzzles in Mario games, believe it or not. And yeah, you know what? Just screw you, Magic Koopa. Bye. Oh, and look, another snake platform. Careful, the statues. What are they gonna do? What What are they doing? Let's turn around. Oh my God, they're firing a laser that we just jumped over. So that pretty much defeats the purpose. Double the hammer bros. And you can actually spin into their hammers and get a star bit. Or jumping on them will work too, I guess. You don't get any reward. I just wanted to kill them just to show that. And now I believe there's a life... Yeah, what life mushroom on the top of this hole if I could ever grab on it. Work it! Work it, Mario! Oh, we actually get a 1-up. I didn't know we had a life extension already. But when you get a 1-up, I mean a life mushroom, if you already have one equipped... Then you just get a regular one-up. So there's this. And then this one you have to hit all three. Now up here it sucks us to where uh, Bowser's going to be. And look at that. Awesome cutscenes. Ah, you're still as giant as ever I see. Wahaha, you showed up! Yes, I did. Look at you running around like a little flea on a puny planetoid. No one isn't puny, my massive new power! The power to flood you like a space pancake! <laughs> space cake pancakes actually sound kind of delicious. It's Tiny Luma. We got this! I got this! And then Bowser comes forward, he's apparently able to float and change gravity. So here's the first Bowser fight of the game. He's gonna be able to do a couple attacks like calling down meteors. Uh, he's gonna do his version of a falcon punch, I guess. So what you gotta do is grab onto a meteor, ground pound it toward him, and then that's going to count as a hit. He's gonna call down more meteors. Uh, I missed that coin by barely an inch. Come on, do your fake falcon punch. Hit him. He's gonna get mad. Ah, oh boy. I better finish this up quick. And... Now he's gonna call down more meteors. Okay, and then he's gonna do this. Oh, boy. I'm really running out of time here. And then he's gonna punch the ground. And there you go. Come on, just go faster, Bowser. I have a time limit, you know. Yeah, breathe fire already. Ole. Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There you go. Alright, I'm still gonna finish this up in the time limit. <laughs> and then Bowser falls to the ground. Come on! I have a time limit. Go faster, Pokey! Move faster, Pokey! Roar! Now I remember why you're my arch, arch nemesis. You're so annoyingly hard to squish. Good thing I win anyway. Ha! Huh. While we've been playing, my mess plan has moved on to the next phase. Tough luck, Mario. Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, go faster, Poke. Move faster, Pokey! Ah, uh, come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Go! 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 Come on! Go! Yes, that's going to be it for this episode. So I'll continue with what we had in the next episode, guys. See you later.